Alright guys, this is going to be how to manually install a boot animation, a different boot animation to your device. This is going to be one that I've actually made, if you can see it, hopefully. Yeah, it's a little hard. Um, <clears throat> we may just have to uh, look at it a different way. But, <clears throat> excuse me guys. Anyway, this is one that I've made. wish you could see it well, but you really can't. It's a gingerbread guy, but pretty cool. And I animated him. Anyway, we'll let this load up and then I'll go into how to show you how to uh, how to uh, take a boot animation and where to put it on your uh, on your internal card and your memory and everything through a file explorer and uh, how to rename it, what we had to do to make it boot up. So we'll, we'll do that. Hang on a sec here. Let this boot and we'll go to that. Well, there now you can actually see it. Yeah, now the screen went dark. Yeah. That's part of it. It actually draws the whole thing and then shows you this. So, all right, here we go. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and unlock it. All right. So there we go. This is my wallpaper. I can also give you guys this if you want it. This is uh, actually a wallpaper I made just for fun. Different uh, Android versions here. Alright, so to do this, we're going to go into our, uh, I got Easy, or ES File Explorer, that's what I like using. We'll open that up. Alright, finally, okay. So, you have to make sure that um, ES File Explorer, whatever root browser you're using, has, has root, obviously. Um, because you need to get into some of the uh, root uh, folders. But let's uh, let's just kind of go through this and see what we got. I'm gonna go to where I have a boot animation stored, which is here and here. So I have a, a couple different zips here. I have a gingerbread one. I have a jelly bean one. I have another one I've made. Um, so let's take this jelly bean three zip, which I know is a boot animation. You're gonna copy it, and we're gonna copy. So. You can see it's down here, it's in my copy se section. So, basically from here, we're gonna back out of this, back out, and you wanna be at the very beginning of your uh, drive here, which is just slash. So, from here, there's two places you can actually install the boot animation. So, I'm gonna show you where it's originally installed, and then I'll show you where I like to install it. So, here's system, and then if you click on media, right here, is your boot animation zip um, and this is the one that comes when on pretty much any Android device the boot animation is stored right here this is where your device looks and says okay let's play this boot animation so you can delete that or back it up somewhere and then put yours there and name a boot animation and it'll play yours by, by taking this and copying and pasting it there and renaming it instead of Jelly Bean 3 zip, renaming it Boot Animation zip, and taking that one and moving it somewhere else or deleting it, that will allow you to play that boot animation. What I like to do is I like to leave that one intact. Totally leave it alone, don't even mess with it, and we're gonna back out to, back to just slash again, the root of your SD card, and we're gonna scroll up to data, and we'll hit data, all right, now we're in data. We're gonna scroll down to local and hit that. And our, here you can see this is another boot an animation zip. So um, this is the boot animation zip that I just played for you guys when I started the video. So if you have a boot animation zip in data local right here, then it will play instead of your boot animation zip that is in uh, system media. So, um, if you delete this one now, it'll it just delete it. It'll go back and it'll play the one that you left in system media, which is probably your original one that came with the device. Um, but if you have one here, it'll play it instead of the other one. So it just it 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 it, it takes priority at data local takes priority over the system media location. So I just leave the one that's original intact and just leave it alone, and I install it under data local. Um, so, if you want to change it, or add it, let's just say we delete this one. 
okay so if you're adding in a new custom boot animation it's gonna look like this basically in data local so you're gonna drag this up and you're gonna take jelly bean and you're gonna hit paste all right so now it's in there but it won't boot unless it's called boot animation so then we gotta come in here and we gotta rename it so you want to make sure you have a lowercase b and then you type in boot animation and it's all one word all right so boot animation dot zip all right so now it's renamed and now when I reboot this device um, we will see the new boot animation that I put on for Jelly Bean if my camera will pick it up so we'll back out and we'll power off and reboot it probably will pick it up and it'll probably do it at the end so this is also a boot animation I was fiddling around with making so I'll probably put it up there too so you guys can check it out if you want come on alright rebooting so that's pretty much it guys um, two places to store your boot to put your boot animations you can have it in system media which is fine or you can have it in data local um, either place should play it and, and then boot it up so here you go hopefully you can see this alright there it boots up like I say I wish you could see it it probably needs to fade out a little bit but uh that's pretty much how you ins uh, manually install a boot animation in two locations, whichever one you guys prefer to do. I prefer, like I said before, data local. Um, but that's it, guys. So if you want to check either of these two out, I'll put them up in the description, um, along with my wallpaper if you want it. And uh, thanks for watching, and uh, let this finish booting up and finish this out, man. Hopefully, like I say, when it dims the screen, you'll be able to see this a little better. It's pretty cool, really. Give it a sec. There we go. Yeah, check it out. I think it's pretty freaking cool. There we go. Alright guys, manual installation of boot animation on Android device. Thanks.